Hello everybody, Venus Storm here, and welcome back to Crusader Kings to the Warhammer Geheimnis Knock mod. In the last episode, again, we continued our work on improving our holdings. Again, something has been continuing for quite some time. We launched another war against Amazonia to take this chunk of territory over here. And that war went fairly successfully. So, we are fine there. We just need to put down the uprisings while the counties are under the Jade Mayhem effect. With the 50% increased revolt risk. So, yeah, they're not happy there, but we'll deal with it. And we are moving an army down south to begin raiding again over here to get some money. And as someone did point out in the comments that I was made a I was mistaken about something here. If you look to the founding of the Empire, I thought that we had to get both three kingdom titles and a realm size of 180, but no, it only says that one of those must be true. So we can get the three kingdom titles, which because we, we have two we can create, and then we just need to have a thousand gold at that point to create an empire. So it's going to cost us 200 gold per title to create the two kingdom titles, and then a thousand gold. Uh, to create the Empire, so we are going to need 1,400 gold to do that, which I don't think that should be too much of a problem. So, let's go ahead and unpause it. Let's get this thing moving. We're currently under Regency because we are off questing for some reason. And I apparently went on a rampage while I was questing. Weird. Alright, managed to sow distrust. Very good. Another raving mob of infidels. No big deal. There we go. That one's over. Alright, you guys. Toggle looter. Get in there. Burn that county down, as we have done several times before. That should hopefully get us a nice pile of cash. Uh, the court. I'm off questing, but I apparently get, got depressed. Which means we might need to go carousing next time someone invites us. See if we can get rid of depressed. Uh, more Amazonian rebels. How long does this last? Until next year. Okay. Alright, we'll just uh, let that siege naturally. Now, do we need to cut back jungle anywhere? Yes, we do. Uh, cut back jungle. I apparently can do it myself. And here, yes. Can you righteously imprison somebody? Okay. Help me fled. Uh, Alright, we have, we're able to successfully cut back the jungle. Very good. Your mission brought you far away from your palace, but it's finally over. And we feel free to return to the usual business. Good. Regency has ended. Cut back jungle. Do it. Select a regent. I guess we'll go with you. Uh, we're gonna do another one of these laws. Okay. This guy. Wasn't he one of my commanders? He was one of my very good commanders.
Like, one of my best commanders just got murdered. Well, that's not great. Uh, I guess we'll go with you for now, and we might need to bring in somebody else. Who is a good marshal? Who will join our court? Preferably somebody of my religion. A little green. Thumbs up. You bring in and make them a commander. Oh, another Amazon revolt. Hold on. really wish I could use the new DLC which has that you know will join court filter but oh well it doesn't seem like there's really anybody here oh wait 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 thirteen I mean, that's not great, but it's better than what I've got. Invite the court. She's 54. Let's see. We can replace you. With you. Right, revolt's over. It must have risen up directly underneath my army, so. Got taken care of quick. Alright. Let's see. What laws can we change while we're sitting here waiting for uh, our looting to get done? We can change realm inheritance. Which would be nice. I think we probably have enough to do it. Uh, light jungles removed. Okay, so we have another. Uh, Trying to cut back that jungle again. Be throwing around all that money. All right, but it's successful. There we go. All right, ah, they approved. So we now have regulated inheritance vassal inheritance regulated delivered to disallow titles to pass outside my realm through inheritance, just in case. I mean, most of my vassals are vampires who shouldn't be dying anyway. But you never know. Alright, so. Another thing I want to look into is my court priest. He's over here. Has that been converted yet? No, it has not. This guy can be imprisoned. Okay. Imprison him. He's an absolutely terrible character. And he died in our dungeons. That was quick. Alright, so... 
One thing we also need to decide is, uh, what are we doing next? I think we might go for this. Because it'll get us some more coast land. Which means we'll get more boats. Oh, we're done? We're done. March out. Turn off looter. Party of soldiers find the banner of minor viceroy Quapton. The chase recently set up camp in the middle of a field belonging to a farmer. The camp was the campfire spread out of control. His entire crop was reduced to ashes. I guess I'll throw around the money to pay for the property damage. Alright, you guys actually march all the way up here. Is it Jay Mayhem gone? Revolt risk? Revolt risk is down. Good. You have negative 10,000 prestige? How did that happen? Someone else can be righteously imprisoned? Yeah, go ahead and... Then, well, fled to another realm. Don't care. I shouldn't actually even need to raise my levies for this. Uh, you guys march here. And then what we'll do is declare war, trade occupation, send it. March our forces in. Salt everything down. Let me back our plot to investigate the alignment. Um, uh, I know. There we go. They surrender. We accept. Okay, and now we need to hand this out to somebody. Realm. My religion and my culture. Who are not rulers, who are not great house. have all of these female courtiers who are oh we need to uh, create this 100 gold okay none of them will join my court we can't make them Vampires. But it might still make this work. Any culture, but he is a blood dragon vampire. This guy is also Blood Dragon. You... Can we transform... No, because you're not human. Are there 
any humans. In my court. Well, there is you. The commander that I brought in. Commander. Well, we could make her commander again, even if we gave her a title. So, let's do this. Let's turn you into a vampire. Let's grant you a landed title. Of this. Yes, because now you should be both my culture and my religion, so yeah. Yeah, grant landed title. Uh, which one was it again? This one. There we go. And then what we'll do is we'll search my realm for my religion and my culture, who are not rulers. And then we'll just take you and grant you the landed title of that. Right? And then we'll grant you the landed title of that duchy. There we go. And then you have a non-dynastic heir. But as long as you don't die, it'll be fine. And then we reappoint you as commander. And we have a new, well, same ambition. Okay. Looks like you've already converted your castles, at least one of them anyway. The prime quality wood found in the forests of Zigitu has attracted the attention of a group of elite artisans. These renowned individuals have set up a concern where they offer their services for a hefty price. For the right price, you could acquire their services and put them to work for the crown. We lose one gold. Just work toward the betterment of the realm. Build time and cost modifier. I'll banish them and seize their assets for one gold. No, we can get that. We got raiders all over the place. One army should be sufficient to hold that area against any rebels. Though it looks like my vassal is now raising his own armies to deal with the problem. Yeah, sure. Why not? All 
All right. More looters. Do we still have this truce? Yep, we still have the truce. Amazon Fanatic Revolt. Ha, they caught the looters. I'll wait for them to finish fighting and then I'll kill whoever's left. Prosperity of our capital is the number of scholars who are looking for a patron, organizing them to a foundation for learning could result in a useful new discovery. As knowledge is power, we lose a large amount of gold for plus 0 0.03 tech points. No, we're not spending that much gold for that little gain. Need to get legalism five. As soon as we get up here, we're going to park. Uh, we got wounded, apparently. Wounded's not bad. Imprison somebody else. Yep. And they fled. Another raving mob of infidels. And I apparently just killed somebody again. but again we have two armies sitting there so any uprising is going to be immediately put down so we'll just have to keep those armies there until that area is pacified Even with the plus 50% revolt risk, it's still... Although of somewhat dubious provenance, Sion Shifan of Plan Planxla has presented me evidence of Zemisha Gao of Amokin is plotting treason against me. How should I respond? Of dubious. Uh, no, we're not doing anything with that. Sometimes you just think all reality is part of a dream, and we became a maniac, which is actually an improvement. Now... When I introduced my friend to Shala, I had high hopes. I hope they will become fast friends. Alright, they had a great time together. Alright, good.
Is there anywhere that has good loot? My moodiness and tendency to lash out at people is getting worse. I sleep too little and can't stop worrying. I became stressed. Right, looks like the re revolts have calmed down. I think I'm gonna go looting over here. All right, got some more tech points. Those culture tech points? No. Up, oh, I will gaze into the jade. Ends of chaos are dangerous levels. So I want to centralize fully. But I need legalism at level 5. Um, I can increase status of women, so let's go ahead and just do that. In your meditation. Your stare cut through the veil of the dark crystal itself. You saw the slopes of the Imperial City, the seat from which the heavenly dragons rule over their subjects. Your will truly is divine, for you've catched a glimpse of their power and made it yours. Magic power two. We got magic power three. Okay, no. We are not going to form a non-aggression pact, no. Alright, status of women has been increased. Yep, they're starting to try and gather their armies. Let's make sure we don't have any actual commanders here. No, we don't. With everything quiet here... No, no, no. Just, just stay here. Seventy-five hundred should be plenty. Now, just out of curiosity, I can bring up twenty boats for my vassals. It's enough to hold two thousand troops. It's not a ton. Alright, well, we burned the one holding down. Now we need to burn the temple down. Shouldn't take too much longer. There we are. And make sure we grab the rest of the loot. A famous writer proposes to compose your family chronicles. Lose some gold. Uh, gain prestige. 15% of gaining proud. Uh, nah, I no, don't want to spend the money. Oh, there you go. Draining the last bit of gold out of there. All 
Alright. You can come back home. Ooh, they have a revolt down here. For what? War to realign leadership. And there's a revolt over here. Revolt war. Uh, anywhere else that looks like it might be a good place to loot. Over here, but I would need some boats. Well, we have the money we need, so let's go ahead and do this. Let's create this title. Actually... We can create this kingdom title. And we can create this kingdom title. And then we can create the empire. Okay, which I think we're actually not gonna do just yet. Because I'm not exactly sure what I want to name the Empire. I'll definitely take some suggestions in the comments. And uh, we'll see what we're going to name our new Empire title. So, uh, we will uh, work, we'll go over that when we come back. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment. And I will see you next time.